Here we need to set up a multiplication equation that we're going to solve by using the division property of equality. So, Mary, so Julie makes 1.25 times the amount of money that Mary makes. If Mary makes $35,000, how much does Julie make? We're going to write and solve an equation. So first off, let's try to understand what the problem is saying. Julie makes more than Mary does because she not only makes 100% or one times what Mary makes, she also makes an additional 0.25 or 25%. So when we get our final answer, we want to make sure that Julie is making more than $35,000. So if we want to do this arithmetic, uh, um, with arithmetic, we could say 1.25 times $35,000 will give us what Julie makes. So let's do that on the side here. Zero, 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 25, 2, 15, 16, 17. Hold the place for the zero. And then 1, 2, 3 zeros, 2 times 5 is 10, carry 1, 2 times 3 is 6 plus 1 is 7. And next, hold 2 places and 3 zeros and 1 times 35. And um, 6 plus 7 is 13, and carry 1, 3 plus 1, 43, with two decimal places. So $43,750. That sounds correct because she does make a bit more than Mary makes. Let's try this equation using a variable. So what we don't know is how much Julie makes. So Julie's going to be our variable, J. And we're going to divide that by 1.25 to return to how much Mary makes. So here we've written an equation. J, Julie's amount, divided by 1.25 equals 35,000. The opposite of dividing by 1.25 is to multiply by 1.25. And those cancel, and we've isolated J. And here you can see, luckily, we've already done the multiplication, 35,000 times 1.25. And our answer is, when we multiply, 43,750. So we've written the equation, J divided by 1.25 equals $35,000, Mary's amount. And we've solved the equation. Julie makes $43,750. $43, Thank you for watching educator.com.